are already seeing the benefits from our 2022 transformation plan and have further accelerated our ESG initiatives. We expect CO2 emissions to be down by 30% in the next four years and non-environmentally friendly packaging to drop by 25% in the same time span. Further changes we plan on making are engaging with local farmers who support organic practices, uh, which is being demanded by all of our customers. Additionally, we will engage in strategic partnerships with agribusinesses focused on sustainable growth and development, such as Cortiva AgriScience. Lastly, we are investing in AI-focused growers to help further promote sustainable growing practices. Our goal by 2030 is to further reduce CO2 emissions by 15%. Our main focus is on our relationships with our suppliers. With margins being squeezed across the industry as demand shifts online, we have had to focus up until now on our bottom line. Going forward, we want to focus on what made Carrefour an industry leader for the last 60 years. With regard to national suppliers, we are looking to invest in blockchain solutions to streamline the entire supply chain and provide immediate and safely encrypted updates in every step of the supply chain. Locally, we are sending corporate employees to train a team of analysts who will utilize our current online platform where it is not already employed. Additionally, we're also creating a new position in every country with a focus on relationship management and hiring experienced locals who will seek to form new supplier partnerships and build our relationships for the long term. Brazil is one of the world's fastest growing markets with a rising middle class and growing e-commerce opportunities. Africa is still far behind, but the two things that we found similar between these two regions when comparing consumer behavior profiles is a focus on value and brand loyalty. As we continue to expand our presence in these regions, we will work with our suppliers to deliver brand name products at lower costs. Our 2018 buying alliance with Tesco is a step toward providing these opportunities to our customers. In addition to promote the growth of local economies, we will work to empower local suppliers, which will drive more demand to our stores. We are looking past the mistakes that we have made and are moving forward. With growing competition from Aldi, Lidl, Casino, Leclerc, and all others in our industry, we formed our buying alliance with Tesco in 2018 to secure better margins on our products from national suppliers. Now we are shifting the focus onto local suppliers. We are creating lines of regional specialty products in every country in which we operate to empower local suppliers and also increase the buying power of the citizens in all of those regions. To ensure that supply matches demand, we are employing the freedom within a framework model. This will give our local managers discretion on which products to promote and sell. Our goal is to expand our presence by bettering the lives of our suppliers and customers in every region in which we operate.